Wayne Simmons is going to play. The Leafs are on the ice tonight, taking on the Flames, hoping to break a two-game losing streak. Wayne Simmons is hoping to help get that win. He's back in the lineup for the first time since February 6th when he broke his wrist. You know, he, he comes in with a positive mindset every day, and that's something I think everyone really wants to be. And it's, it is hard to be every once in a while, but um, he does it He does it very, very well. And it's something that uh, you want to be around. Also returning to the lineup Friday night is Jack Campbell. This is his first time dressing since February 27th against Edmonton. Making his debut tonight for the Leafs is Alex Galchenyuk. The 27-year-old will play in a line with Johnny T and William Nylander. He's played very well with the, with the Marlies and perhaps even more importantly, has handled himself very well and uh, he's got lots of confidence, uh, really feeling good about his game. So I think, uh, you know, the timing is, is right. Yeah for all those reasons. Obviously, the Raptors are hoping to snap their six game losing streak tonight when they take on the Jazz and it looks like they're going to be as close to full strength than we've seen them in weeks. All of the players who were in the NBA's health and safety protocols for the Raptors have been cleared to return to play. We saw Siakam and Van Vliet join the team in Wednesday and tonight OG Ananobi is expected to make his return. The Blue Jays season opener is just under two weeks away when they are hosted by the Yankees. Fans are hoping to see pitcher Nate Pearson in the opening day lineup, but he has been out since March 1st with a right groin strain, and the team is trying to figure out when he can make a return to the mound. Just getting further evaluations just to make sure we figure this thing out, and, uh, and our medical staff is doing everything they can for sure. And, you know, again, it's just uh, he, he's a little frustrated right now with, with, with you know, having that setback, but we're, we're in a position where, you know, I think we'll – We'll get him right, and the next time you see him, he'll be feeling great. And in Raptors 9 of 5 news, Gary Payton II was named the G League's Defensive Player of the Year. He's the third player in franchise history to receive the award. The last player to get it was Chris Boucher in 2019. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.